Hi, my friends. Welcome back. We have one episode. Well, we have a new story with Mean Girls. I'm going back to Mean Girls because it's about time anyway. So let's just get so with. Hey there. Welcome to Mean Girls Sorority Watch. Ask is finally over. It's time to spread your, spread your wings to explore who you are. You flirt with hot college guys. Damn yeah. What? Regina is George is gone. It's time to live life. Regina George is never gone. She's gone on the other side of the country. Mark my words. She's never gone. So have you decided on an outfit? Decided? I'm going off to college. I need to look fashionable, but not too fashionable. Sophisticated, but not too sophisticated. You know? I do. All six outfits you try to look great. Guys, okay, it's time to go. How many? No, I need to down to three. I think I'll just try something. Ooh! Mm. Okay, this good. looks good enough. Perfect. This is it. You look great. Carolyn, Amy is here. Need to write down. Go ahead, Katie. I'll be there in a sec. Okay. College. Wow. So long, old life. Mom, really? Oh, sweetie, I'm just so proud of you. You're going to spread your wings in college. You're going to be a sore. What's Mom, speaking of soaring, Helen, did you tell her about Delta Ma Mutau? Delta Mu what? It's a sorority, Mom. It's the sorority. They nurtured politicians, astronauts, award-winning actresses, pretty much everything. I'm going to rush the MIT chapter when I get back from Africa. My goodness, that sounds amazing for you, Caroline. I know, but it's really competitive. And you remember last. I trust you make the right choices, honey. Now, one picture. Now, one more. Punk. Oh, oops, I wasn't supposed to say that. Alright, I need to go. Good luck, Caroline. You too. Have a amazing semester. Let's go. Bye! Love you, honey! Say hi to Megan for me. I'm gonna miss her. Me too. No turning back now. Oh my god, you look somewhat look like you someone died. We're driving to freedom, Caroline. No high school, no parents, no Regina George. I know, it's really exciting. I just don't want to screw this up. It's college. I want to find my place to do something big. You can start by helping Jess and get me to get the password. The password? Dita P. Chi throws a legendary back to school party. But you need the password to get in. They host with, they host it with Dr. M Mutau. Dr. Mutau! If you want a chance at the sorority, this party is critical. How do you get me get the password? A sorority leader has to give it to you. It's crazy competitive, but you were born for competition. I don't know. Last year, I lost to Regina George. Regina George is on the other side of the country. You, you got this. University of Evanston. Janice, there you are. There you are. I've been passing the time watching frat guys injuring them, themselves on the flipping side. Janice, I just want to get us the password. You really do care about this stupid Greek party? Of course. It's a party that is essential to getting into a Greek program. Now, if you excuse me, I'm going to mingle with that table of hotties. Ahoy, sailors. Maybe fat boy Damien will get be his new thing. Hey, did you get a look at the art program yet? No way. I would never have subscribed to it if this was the nationalism of the creative spirit. I'm taking the journalism route. My intimate racker has been itching to get out. If you really tapped your potential, you should think about joining a sorority. OMG, that's a mud tool. Uh, okay, think about it. And. Ouch, brain cramp. 
Did you know the last four valedictorians at the U of E, at University of Evanston, were Delta Matuas? Not to mention the former mayor of Chicago, two congresswomen, and the inventor of the two socks. Have you heard of us? Um, very cool. I have. Looks like we have a lot of great stories at this school. We do. Great, to, great that you keep an open mind. Or, I'm Caroline. Michelle, I'm the VP. So, Michelle, I heard Dr. Mulu is holding a party tonight. Yeah, the password party is an old Dr. Mulu tradition. Alright. Can I say I adore your haircut? I'd I love to get the name of your stylist. You're so sweet. I wish I gave him the password, but we weren't allowed to invite anyone else. The story press says we're over capability. It's just a stupid party. You don't need to be so exclusive about it. Janice! That's okay. The password thing is a little silly, but the rules are rules. Sorry, Caroline. I understand. Nice meeting you, Michelle. Any luck? Nope, you? No. Hey, Caroline. Listen, you're really cool, and I want to help you get the pa that password. I can't tell you what it is, but I can point to you in the right direction. What do you say? Oh, wow, really? That would be amazing. No. That wouldn't quite feel right. Really appreciate the offer, though. Anytime. Oh, well. Not oh, well. We were in college. We are in college now, Caroline. Time to do something big, right? But we're going to that we're going to that party. <laughs> Mike is here. Good, invite him. We'll we'll break into that party if we have to. Oh we got this I gotta see this. It's good to see you. It's been two days. Still, you're the only one I want to see before crashing a Greek party. I'll meet you there. I got a, a film school meeting me just before. I'm sure you're impressed with your knowledge of left. I am a primitive. I'm sure. Try to use it. And then it's good luck. Ahem. Oh, hi. You must be Borsha. I'm your roommate, Caroline. We have a no PDA policy in this room. Uh, we need to discuss that. Not, not that it'll matter in a couple of weeks. High school relations have an extremely high fate value when they transition to college. Well, Borsha, no one asks you. No need to get defensive, new roomie. I'm merely sharing the facts. I saw an infographic. <laughs> that is so true. That is so true. Anyway, I'm going to check out that Greek party. What? The Delta Matua party? You got the password? Yeah, I yes, I did. Uh, can you share it? Sure, in exchange with no PDA policy. What? No way. No way. You tell her. You're lost. I know she's lying. Well, ready to break into that party? One sec, I got something for you. What kind of something? A dress. You should wear it to the party tonight. It, it's hanging over there. Go try it on. Wow, you look incredible. That tells how much fools will love it. I better not, but thanks. Sorry, Micah. Without further ado, shall we check out this party? Let's go. Yeah, a lot of high school relations break up a lot. It's a myth, but that's not true. If you, you just need this, a lot of support in each other if you're going to have a high school relationship in college. But that's a, that, but, uh, but yeah. The Delta Matua party. We have a document this. We're in college now, Carolyn. Tingle, tingle wings. Looks like I just got here just in time. But you, you're supposed to be at, at, believe it's sexes, sexies. Three more spots at the party. Perfect. I love parties. Next, next on Carolyn Uncensored. Why is Carolyn gaping like a fish? Regina Joyce is back. And I thought she was on the other side. Anyways, thank you for watching. See you on the next, the next episode of Mean Girls So I Watch. Well, after three, after two hours of filming. I mean, getting mad passes back. So anyways, goodbye.